Good afternoon, everybody. Elsie and I. Well, good afternoon, everybody. Jerome and I. No, 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 no. We're going to this place called Isla Manila, which is um, Filipino food. Apparently, they have like dim sum, but it's like Filipino food. But um, it's gorgeous outside, so we'll show you what we eat. So we are here at Manila, Isla Manila, and it's like all you can eat dim sum, but it's like Filipino food. So uh, it comes with arroz caldo, which is kind of like a chicken rice soup, and Elsie and I got a uh, sweet tea. Is it good? How is it? Is it is it really sweet? I like mine really sweet. It's actually just perfect, like not too sweet, not too like watered down. Mm, oh, there she's she's coming. Oh, she's not coming. So like right when Elsie said, what did you say? Like a I second like, ago. Uh, I said, I hope you have pizza, and like two seconds later, oh, here's some lumpia, guys. Like, it's in a dim sum, like, container, yeah. like a steam container. Cray. Cray, cray. So, can you explain to me what um, this is? Well, Just like the whole concept? Of, like, dim sum. Yep. <laughs> but with a fixed price of $13.99 today. Uh huh. Um, but we call it flip sum, actually. Flip sum. Yeah. Oh, that's so, funny. Here we go. What are the top items you would say? Or um, that people pork like. and chicken adobo is actually our top one. So uh -huh. Unset, of course, because a lot of people are very familiar with that. Oh my uh, God. Beef calderas uh, also. Yeah. Um, our pork adobo was actually featured in Seattle Weekly. Oh. Ooh. Yeah. So, so that a, we'll have to get that for sure. Yeah. And then also our dinaguan was also featured in Seattle Weekly. Overall, we were actually in Seattle Weekly. And they gave us a really good review. And a lot oh, of people seem to like it. And but barbecue stuff is also popular. Lemon chicken's my personal um, favorite. Yeah. Good morning, everybody. Actually, it's not morning. It is one o'clock. But it's Sunday, and it's gorgeous outside. And I've probably said that the past two vlogs, but it's true. Like, you know, Seattle's known for its crappy weather nine months of the year it rains and when it's sunny we really appreciate it and it's really sunny right now it's probably like 82 degrees but I'm heading over to my cousin Isa's house we're all are gonna go to this food truck festival in Seattle hey guys so right now we are we just parked oh wait what are you doing you're like on top of your wagon that uh, we just parked and we're heading oh it's a dog there's a dog there's a dog across the street. We're heading over to the Fremont Food Festival and it took us probably like 30 minutes to find barking. But, we're here with the kiddos. Kayo, hi. Hey, you said it's 501 City app, right? Yes, and, okay. and Lana, and Isa, right there. So we're gonna walk over there and, and stuff our faces with food from 35 different food trucks. So we just got here at the Fremont Food Rodeo. Apparently it's a rodeo, not a festival, but the lines are so long here. There's so many people here. Um, apparently it takes like an hour to wait in line and another like 30 minutes to wait for your food and get it. But I don't know, I don't know what we're gonna do. That's where Sheena is. Inside the beer garden? We can't go to the beer garden, unfortunately, because of we have these kiddos here. Just walking on the farmers market, the food truck thing was so was so busy. But Lana, turn around, and say hi to the camera. <laughs> so we are now at Green Lake, and it's still sunny. We went and got some food. Some pizza, some cupcakes, and now the kids are gonna go play in the Lana, sand. Here. Wanna bring your bucket? <laughs> Kayo's so excited to go. Okay, we're gonna eat too. Bye. Okay. <laughs> this is the end of the day. Hi, Kayo. Bye. 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 Oh, God. Good afternoon everybody, it is, um, I just got out of work, and earlier today it kind of sucked because it was super um, overcast and cloudy outside, and I already had plans with my friends Roger and Jordan to go hiking, but of course, you know, timing, uh, the sun comes out right when I got out of work, so we decided it's a go, and we're gonna go to Twin Falls in North Bend, if you know the Seattle area, to go hiking. So come along with us and we'll show you beautiful views, and 
um, my friends too, so stick around. Hello everybody, I'm here at Twin Falls with Jordan <laughs> and Roger. Uh, we're, it's so nice outside, so we're just gonna go hiking and I hope you're not running all the way up there. We are. Whatever, I'm gonna... I'm gonna, I'm gonna see them like another 50 feet away and they already like out of breath. But, um, yeah, there's a nice little creek right over here. And hopefully we don't die. I actually have some food back here for, you know, I have a banana, some pretzels, and a big uh, bottle of smart water, so. So we decided to do a little bit of a jog on this incline. And we decided to take a little bit of a walking break. Oh, the trees are so tall here. It runs up all the way there. So beautiful. But um, we're not done yet. We're gonna go all the way to the top and we'll show you what we find. And I sound like I'm out of breath because I kind of am. Fuck it. There. What are you guys looking at, guys? Oh, there's um, an animal. <laughs> An animal. <laughs> I'm trying to Google the animal online to see what kind of animal it was. Oh. <laughs> Did you see an animal? Yeah. Oh. You know, doing nature stuff. Okay. Look what we found. A little friend. Oh, stop pushing me! This is um, Sluggy Slug. The slugger. Anyways. The camera just saw you almost chip, Roger. The camera does not lie. <laughs> Anyways, we're, um, the waterfall is somewhere down that way if you can hear it, but still walking the trail. So we are walking down towards the midsection of the waterfall. Wow. Nice. Was it worth it, guys? Yeah? Roger? Taking pictures? And then you got me, who's a little bit sweaty. I don't care. But uh, yeah, the waterfall's kind of. There's more to go down there, I think, but we're not going down there. Taking some pictures. Another part of the waterfall. Got Jordan here. What are you doing? Texting. Texting, you have service? I don't have service. But anyways, um, yeah, we're a little bit out of breath. I'm gonna grab something to eat from my uh, backpack. And yeah, this was a really fun day. I got some cardio out of the way. Bye. Bye. <laughs> we're, uh, afterwards, we're probably gonna go to, where are we going after? Uh, we're gonna go to Korean barbecue. Korean we'll barbecue. Some pork belly and kimchi. Pork belly. And rice. Oh. And kabi. Yum. And lots of food. Yes. So, oh my god, what did we just run into, guys? Jerome. <laughs> Jerome. <laughs> we ran into a Jerome. Jerome no. in nature. <laughs> no, there was a there was a big frog that was like orange and it jumped on your leg. Looks Almost. Like Jerome too. <laughs> orange. <laughs> Bitch, I'm better looking than a frog. You look like a fucking toad or a caterpillar. <laughs> Anyways, it all it jumped almost jumped in your leg, Roger? Yes. It's really <gasps> scary. But yeah, it's getting a little bit dark and What's that? What? <laughs> so this is really pretty, walking back to the car. The sun's kind of this parallel to our face, but really nice and enjoyable trail back. And we're all getting hungry. And they're, they're like twins. Black shorts, black tank. Except Jordan, Jordan's wearing a, <laughs> a wife beater underneath his black tank. Hey guys, so we're right now, right, right now we are going to Korean barbecue. We're so excited. Um, oh, this is Jordan, this is Jordan's excited dance. I'm so excited! <laughs> he does the, what's your favorite song? Turn the beat around. By Gloria Estefan. Oh gosh, anyways, we're gonna go get Korean barbecue and then we'll show you what we get. So I forgot to say that I did a little outfit change. Um, now it's like a dry fit green, lime green uh, shirt. And this is, we don't have our stuff yet, but this is the, what would you call this? The little, the grill. I was gonna say steamer, but we're not doing that stuff. Um, Jordan went to go poop. And um, are you cooking? 
No, you're not I'm just gonna eat. Okay, well, wait for it, things to be over or undercooked. Just like we got our banchan. That's right, bitch. You better cook for us. What did he say? Fuck me? He said fuck me. I won't. No. This is the cooked food. Thank you, Jordan. So, we're, so they asked me if I wanted to have shrimp and I don't want to open it or peel it. So what did you say is a good mark for a good boyfriend? <laughs> so he said, you know a guy is a keeper if they peel. Yeah, shrimp, yeah. Babe, you peel my shrimp? <laughs> Fuck you, no. <laughs> Kel, uh, you, you, used to, you used to peel your ex's shrimp all the time. Does that mean you're a keeper? He's a keeper. Fellas! Jordan! Jordan, thank you for peeling my my shrimp. Are you a keeper? Obviously. <laughs> so uh, uh, if you if, if anybody is interested also leave in the comment box below. My number is 206. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so you probably saw this place uh, like five minutes ago in this vlog. We're back at the flip sum Filipino dim sum place called Isla Manila Bar and Grill. We're gonna go eat. I'm kind of hungry. I'm with my mom and the Liadors. <laughs> so we're gonna eat. Let's eat. Bye. So we just got all of our food. A whole bunch of stuff. Um. Yeah. Irish, which one's your favorite dish so far? The everything barbecue. It's gone. Oh, it's all gone. I ate it all. You ate it all? Actually, when we first came here, she didn't have a plate. And the guy was like, Did you think it was a cookie? Like a coconut cookie? And you just ate it? <laughs> I don't even know if I ate it or not. I'm that hungry. But is this fulfilling everything you wanted? So, we have cassava cake. From the cassava root, the cassava root. Kaina <laughs> tayo. So we're just eating. My mom knows the owner apparently. She's like, she's like popular here apparently. I thought I was popular, but no. Tell us, how does it taste? Masarak. Jack Namit, Jack Brut. Oh, Namit? That's you. In your in your cassava cake? Oh. So we ended up getting hollow hollow. Halo Halo. It's basically like um shaved ice with ice cream, leche flan. Looks like there is beans and jackfruit and coconut shavings underneath and condensed milk. Taking pictures. Nom! Hey guys, so I'm here with Rachel. Hi! She's shooting a music video. You remember her from the last vlog. <laughs> um, I'll give a, do a little footage. Um, so yeah, we're at this place called the... What's it called? T-S-U-E <laughs> Co. Chon Co. So it's basically factory. like a, a factory fortune for fortune factory. cookies and uh, noodles. So yeah, I'm like a little bit sweaty. So we'll show you what we do. Bye. So we're supposed to write like what our dreams are, so mine is, I want to travel the world and eat everything. And then, this is the setup right here. It's kind of cool, but maybe I'll try to do a little footage of me doing it, but I don't know if I'm going to. It's really nice here to go to the factory, and I used to come here when I was like second grade, and it's kind of hot, but um, yeah. Oh, I think I'm next. Hey guys, I don't know if it's super windy in the video, but I'm here with Jill, cousin. We are going to watch Pentatonix. Um, if you don't know who they are, um, they're the winner of season three, the sing-off. They basically sing, uh, oh, I don't want to die. This car, this, this, the semi-truck is like scaring us by beep. Well, actually, we are at the right. We're not on the road. Uh, they're the winners of season three of, Pent of uh, the sing-off. They basically are a group that don't perform with background music. Their voices are their background music. So um, I'll leave um, a little link below of their YouTube channel too. So we're inside and we got some Hefeweizen. Thank you. I'm gonna give her 
You're welcome. We're gonna down this. Actually, Jill, we need a. The stage looks kind of cool. Has the blue lights on it. Um, are we gonna drink this? We're not gonna drink it all at once, though. We gotta let it last. <laughs> Just waiting until it starts. Hello, people are here. We're gonna stay. 